Hi everyone, today we have a new video review and as you can see this time we are going to talk about Treasuries from Masterbox. Uh, this kit is molded in 135 scale and here we have the uh, uh, series of Russian-Ukrainian war. It's a kit number 9 and here we have the Special Operations Forces Sniper Group. As you can see there are two figurines in a quite interesting configuration I would say. And those guys might be handy for some diorama project, maybe also solo build, but we have a commercial sample here so it means you'll get exactly the same stuff as what you'll see in this video review and we have a chance to open it and check the parts closer so as I said it should be already available you can get it in Modelimex webshop and what we have here is the uh, I would say the figurine set uh, the series which we already reviewed and here on the side you can see also some safety advices on the opposite side you'll also find two other languages and here we have also the assembly manual so here we have also the parts map because parts as far as I remember they are not numbered on the sprue here you can also see that the assembly manual combines uh, the marking guide as well and we have also the camouflage and and also the colors chart and as you can see the colors chart is given in several manufacturer designations so you will be able to find the uh, necessary color shade I can see also on the bottom we have the uh, text written that this kit is part of the general composition consisting of nine kits and this is quite interesting to combine them together and again small reminder that we reviewed some of them and you can find it easily on our channel so it's a side opening box and inside we will find only one plastic sprue and I'm going to open it right now because it's a resealable plastic bag so it's quite easy and quick to open and then we will check closer what is actually uh, supplied here and why this kit is interesting in four 135 scale modelers. So if I zoom in here you can see one and only plastic sprue and as you can guess, uh, each of the halves is dedicated to one of the figurines. Poses are predefined here. We have also uh, separate arms, legs, one piece torso as far as you can see. But note that the torso is molded together with these vests. So you will have to be careful while painting all of this stuff. And of course it will be quite important to get the smooth connection between all of these things. So that they will look more or less realistic. And if we zoom in even closer here you can take a look at the weapons so the weapons are quite nice here they are molded as a single piece parts and I think with the uh, careful painting you can get a really nice result and overall let's not forget that this is a 135 scale plastic kit not a resin kit so that's why it's even more impressive but of course I will be happy to hear your opinion about such figurine sets so do not forget to write it here in the comment section below and I will see you in the next video review as usual thank you for joining me today and bye Bye.